Hi, and welcome to Chair Balance. I'm Laura Wilson, and today we are going to be using a chair to work our balance from some different ways. Um, make sure that whatever chair you have is nice and sturdy, flat base. Um, it doesn't necessarily need a back, but it may help you for some of the uh, stuff we're going to be doing. So make sure that it's on a nice level area that's not going to slide or wobble and meet me back here. Meanwhile, please check out the links in the description below. I've got some warm-ups, cool-downs, a uh, link to my Patreon page. So please check those out for me. Let's go ahead and begin standing tall. We're going to do just a little balance assessment. So holding on if we need to, let's shift our weight to one leg and just lift the other foot up a little bit. Just notice how much rocking there is in our ankle and leg. Let's keep our core tight. We're going to be doing some core work here in a moment. Everything ties into our balance. Let's shift over to the other side. And again, we're just taking an assessment how this side is balanced compared to the other side. Woo. And let's go ahead and we'll have a seat in our chair. And let's come enough forward that we get our sit bones planted. And let's start to lock in our core. So belly pulling in and up, chest lifting, shoulders back and down. So just working on those good posture muscles for a moment. Let's also take a few deep breaths. And then let everything go. And just notice how that feels. So let's lock it in again, belly in and up, chest up, shoulders back and down. Noticing how that feels. So we're gonna keep this lock in and lift one foot. So shift over to that other sit bone. And just notice how the core kicks in on this. Lift up, shift over to the other sit bone and lift. So we should be able to do this without our hands on anything. Let's come back, shake it out, lock it in. And this time we're going to shift back just a little bit. Come on to our toes. If you're feeling it, we can lift feet up. This is our boat pose in a chair. Release, shake that out. Let's come forward. So this is allowing us to see the effect that our uh, core has on our balance. So let's shift over to one sit bone. This time we'll lift our leg up straight. Bring that down, shift to the other sit bone, and we'll lift the leg out straight. If you need to keep it bent, keep it bent. And let's bring that down. All right, on both sit bones, let's do it again. Onto our toes, lift our feet, or even take them straight. We're not leaning back against the back of the chair. We're working these core muscles. Shake that out. So let's begin to look at our ankles and the part that they play in our balance as well. In our chair, we can actually come onto the edges, give ourselves a little stretch to the outer ankle. Let's take it forward and flex our feet, get the back of our ankle. And this next one's tricky. We wanna lift up, come onto the inner edges of our feet and kind of keep that stretch. Release, and let's just do a little pointing of our toes, pushing our feet forward so that we get that stretch across the front. Shake that out. Let's take our feet into the air again. A little rotation in our ankles. All right, let's release, and we're gonna stand back up and come beside our chair. So we looked at our core, we worked our ankles. Let's begin to shift over and let's lift that first foot again and just do another assessment right here. Well, if it's any better, maybe not. Keeping our core locked in. Shift over and you'll notice that I'm staring in one spot. We're gonna look at vision here in a moment. So making sure that we can hold on to the chair. Let's shift to that first leg. And you can try this without the chair, just turning our head to look to one side. 
Let's look at the other wall. And then we'll look straight ahead to whatever it was we were staring at before. Let's bring it down, shift our weight. And again, we'll look to one wall, holding on if we need to, other wall. And if you can find something on each wall to really focus on, let's look straight ahead again. Shake that out. All right. Well, thank you for joining me today. Work on these kind of exercises every day, especially if you do sit in a chair a lot. It's a way that you can work your core and uh, build that strength there that helps us with our balance. We can also work our ankles to help us with balance work as well. So give this a shot several times a day, every day, and let me know in the comments below if it helps improve your balance at all. All right, see you next time.